Millery's Boat Harbour contains Aqua, the Aquarium of Western Australia, a world-class exhibit. Join Ken and Margaret Richmond and myself as we explore this fascinating marine world. As shown, the aquarium possesses an excellent website. The harbour was created in 1987 for the America's Cup challenge in Fremantle. And uh, in 1988, Sorrento Key was opened. The opening occurred just before the beginning of the America's Cup. Welcome to Aqua, the Aquarium of Western Australia, to take an underwater journey of a lifetime. It's not only Australia's largest aquarium and underwater tunnel, but has a large collection of West Australian mar marine life, beautiful living coral, giant sharks, rays and turtles, and playful seals. It's well worth the money. There's a write-up about the West Australian history, particularly Aqua's shipwrecked coast, where many ships floundered on the reefs. The aquarium is divided into different areas, illustrating different types of marine life found in Western Australia. Meet octopuses, rock lobsters, seahorses, and lion's fish in exhibits illustrating Perth's coastline. In the much colder seas of Western Australia's Southern Ocean, you can see the mystical leafy sea dragons. This map shows the location of Hillary's Boat Harbor in Sorrento. A map illustrating the Boat Harbor. The Aqua Center is located at the bottom left-hand side. And an aerial photograph. An aerial photograph showing the Aqua Center itself. This panoramic view of five slides illustrates the Boat Harbor over 180 degrees. One can relax in many restaurants, sitting outdoors and overlooking the harbour. Let's quickly take a look at Sorrento Key, the shopping area. Dine outdoors and admire the seagulls and the view of the harbour. There are many condominiums for sale and rent at the Boat Harbour. A look at the shopping inside. This shop grabbed Ken Richmond's attention because he loves yachts and boats. There's all kinds of marie, marine uh, exhibits. Margaret, Ken and myself decide on fish and chips overlooking the harbour. Margaret then goes shopping. She's struck by the many tourist exhibits. 
There's lots of surf shops. Well, it's time to move on from the shopping. We head off towards the Aqua Center, the Aquarium of Western Australia. It's quite an arts building. And there are many small aquariums. We explore around. There's a whole series of exhibits on shipwrecks along the western coast. It's for good reason it was called the Shipwreck Coast. Next we decide to explore the undersea tunnel where the fish swim right over our head. It's possible to sleep here at nights as well. We stand on a little conveyor belt. We leave the undersea tunnel and explore some of the themes. First of all, the shrimp. Then Australian Western rock lobster, which I do love to eat. There are separate aquariums set, set up to illustrate the different geographical areas. Let's look at Scarborough. Mindari Keys. And of course, Rottnest Island one of my favorite marine areas. I used to drive past Coburn Sound every day on my way to work as a school psychologist in Rockingham. Seahorses are fascinating creatures. Rowley Shoals is located up north, 250 kilometers off Broome. One exhibit which really caught my attention was on dangerous creatures of the sea. They hit them all. Poisonous sea snakes. They are terrifying. The lionfish with its venomous spikes. A whole range of different marine creatures. The shark, of course. The uh, box jellyfish, or Portuguese man-o-war, is particularly a worrisome venomous creature. There's even quite a number of toxic fish. Cone shells can be deadly as well.
Well, we head out into the warmth and light to look at the seals. Then comes the stingrays. As we look at the stingrays, we can also see the harbor. It's quite a view from the aqua center. We also see the Marmion Marine Park, which lies directly off the boat harbor. It was set up as a marine park at the same time as the boat harbor itself. Here's Ken Richmond checking out the marine park. Margaret Richmond can't wait. She's off to the tourist shop located in the Aqua Center. Ken looks on with dismay as Margaret spends her money. Well, that's it. Thanks, viewer, for joining Ken and Margaret Richmond and myself, Dawn, for this trip at Hillary's Boat Harbor and the West Australian Aquarium. I do hope you have a really nice day.